Okay guys, so we might have some brand new Venom rumors and characters that are being confirmed. Now there's nothing to go about this and the people reporting them are shoddy at best with how many they've had uh, wrong as opposed to how many they've had correct. But we're going to talk about them anyway and I'm going to talk about why this kind of seems like somewhat of a no-brainer. But then again, maybe not. But we'll talk about that. So first up, they are reporting that one of the characters in the movie is going to be the wife and successful lawyer who actually defends Eddie Brock. Now, in the comics, she also does become bound with the Venom symbiote, and she becomes She-Venom. Now, we don't know much other than that, but apparently they are looking for actresses between the age of 25 and 32. Now, honestly, this doesn't seem like anything crazy, but what I'm expecting and what I'm kind of a, like getting from this is the fact that they're just going through the comics and going, well, this character is important and we can't just make it about Eddie Brock alone because it's not going to feature Spider-Man, so we're going to do this movie different. What other way to do it different than include his wife, who's inevitably going to divorce him, and maybe she gets symbio. So it kind of sounds like a what we might expect down the road. And I'm not fully inclined to believe it, considering we've had multiple other sources literally come out and say that Carnage is going to be the primary villain. Now granted, this report never says she's the villain, or that she's going to become She-Venom. But then, if they cast a female, that can claim they were correct on that one. But that's like me saying... I anticipate Scarlet Witch in the next Avengers movie. You know, it's a given it's going to happen. So honestly, I believe, you know, the wife is going to be in there. That seems like a good take on it because he needs some characters to bounce off him and characters to work with. He can't just be there alone and evil. But then on the other hand, definitely I'm not believing she's going to be, you know, She-Venom or anything like that at all in this. So I guess we're just going to have to wait and see how this shakes out on personally. I'm kind of excited by, you know, if she's going to be in there and if they're going to have a bigger connection or maybe flesh out Eddie Brock as a real human being who's not just out after, like, revenge, then that sounds pretty damn awesome and gets me a lot more excited than I was previously. But then, on the other hand, this could go south very, very fast. So I guess we'll have to wait and see. 